Wake up, pal. The big man wants to talk to you. They were roughing me up, but I wasn't talking. My lips were sealed. Pretty soon you'll say plenty. Get the hypodemic, Doc. They could do their worst, but truth drugs don't do anything to me. I've got the willpower of... Whoa! A dark hole opened up under me and I fell right in. I didn't know who I was. I'm Peter Mache. I'm Peter Mache. Or what I was doing. Find the fabulous plaster parrot for me. Inside is a 300 carat diamond. Hey, Flatfoot, snap out of it. Wake up. Suddenly, I felt myself being dragged back to the surface. He is coming around. You may ask your questions now. Okay, Flatfoot, you better have some answers. Who sent you, and what do you want? I wasn't going to tell him a damn thing. Of course, I didn't really know anything, so that part was going to be easy. Hey, this mug's pretty tough. Give him another shot, Doc. All the truth drugs in the world couldn't get me to admit that I never kissed a girl until I was 20. Hey, where did that come from? I'm scared of spiders. I didn't mean to say that. I'd better stop this before I admit I wet the bed as a teenager. Come on, Pete. It's time to get a grip on reality. Try to remember. What was it I saw in that room? Oh, yes. They were doing things that weren't anatomically correct. Suddenly, my head was spinning. Ricky Ricardo was beating out Babalu in double time. I couldn't hold on any longer. My mind exploded into a thousand fragments and everything went black. At last I woke up. My head was on straight, but what about the rest of me? Oh, hello. I seem to have fallen asleep in your trunk. I wonder if you could... Great. <laughs>